I started making music when I was six years old. We had a piano at home and my dad gave me like this big old reel-to-reel -reel recorder with the little microphone that came with it. And so I just started recording what I was playing. Occasionally I would ask my brother or my friends to play some you know, homemade um, percussions. Um, and so I would record day after day and until I had my, my tape full, I would just paint some kind of artwork and consider I have, a, I have an album. And I would listen to it for about a week and then I would just start another album. And this is the kind of approach I'm, I'm using up until today. It's just the tools that I use have changed. But I do like that kind of do-it-yourself thing where, where I just make music really just for myself initially. Since my early days I was involved in a lot of different projects and a couple of bands but at about 15 I decided to go solo and that's where the EO thing came in. And I didn't set out too many goals other than just be really versatile in what I do and express myself through um, different sounds, different ways, like different kind of genres uh, because I love music and I I just I can't really do just one thing forever. Um, it has to be um, everything. Um, my very first album came out in 2003, which was kind of like a Joni dark ambient, and followed by the um, jazzy melodic EP. And after that, I just released a bunch of uh, experimental electronic stuff, ranging from you know heavy thing to some really easy listening, and it's just. It's just what I like to do, really. I mean, I make music for myself first and foremost. And I'm still just trying to express myself through, through all these different ways. And I hope a lot of people can relate to my music. My inspiration comes from, from my life, from relationships, and from just day-to-day -day thing and um, occasionally I am inspired to make music while listening to other kind of music and obviously I do feel inspired by just listening to my own stuff. Um, but yeah, also uh, the gear that I'm using, you know, my, the, the environment where I make my music is also very inspiring and the fact that I have my studio set up in a bedroom really plays a big plays a big role in, in into the picture because like I, I couldn't work if I had my studio set up somewhere else and I had to travel to it just to make music then it would really feel like having a job and that's the thing that's the kind of thing I don't want to feel when I make music so it's really comfortable when I just I can make music anytime I want you know I can take a break I can have a tea or whatever uh, in between of making music. When I perform, I usually perform live 
uh, my own stuff um, in my sets are very uh, each time I play it's very different see if I got like, there's never two same sets um, I might play like, same tracks from time to time but they, every time I would play them they would be presented differently and obviously um, it depends on what kind of gig I'm playing. Sometimes my sets are very eclectic, say a festival type of thing where I would just start really slowly and then go really fast and heavy. And sometimes if it's, a, if it's kind of a rape type of thing, I would be more, <laughs> I would be more straightforward and I would just play maybe kind of jungle thing. Um, but yeah, I've tried, I'm trying to be, well, I'm not trying to be experimental, it's just that it happens that I'm very experimental because ordinary music to me is just kind of boring and I don't know, just just, just who I am and I always, I always try to show what I can do and maybe, I don't know, inspire other people and surprise other people and just, you know, not always deliver what I'm expecting to because that's who I am, I'm pretty spontaneous musician and, and, and in, 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 in my own life I'm also like a spontaneous person so I guess my music is about me and it's like my mirror my, of who I am. Yeah, spread the love and do what you want to do and just be good to each other, be kind and be loving and peace.